Hello and welcome to another Bosco's Toy Box where I'm back with more toy collectibles. And as you can see here, my table is filled with uh, mostly die cast cars. Uh, some of it is premiums and toys. I went to uh, Epic Thrift Store yesterday and uh, I just went there on a whim and because I didn't know that they were having a 50% off sale. But they were having a 50% off sale off everything. Uh, except for like their Christmas and Halloween stuff, even though it's, um, uh, what is it here, like November 7th or 8th right now. But uh, lucky me, they just set out bags of uh, toys, premiums, Hot Wheels for uh, $3. And with the 50% off, I got each bag for $1.50. So much stuff here. I'm just I'm not gonna go into great detail. I'm just gonna kind of show you stuff So as you can see here, this is a McDonald's uh, kind of a NASCAR, but it is a uh, Hot Wheels from 1989 And next up I got uh, It is a this says made in China, but it says construction group S&C Okay the, uh, let's see, I'm going to show you all three of, I think there's three, there might be four around here somewhere, but right now there's three of these cheapies that you find at uh, Dollar Tree. So it looks like that, uh, you got pool uh, cue balls or uh, pool balls on that one. You've got star special and some kind of lightning strikes bolts. Okay. And those will go on my cheapy car collection. Uh, this is a, now, uh, in this collection, I got a lot of these cars called, uh, Tomikas or Tomikas. I don't know how it's pronounced, but this is from, uh, there's no year, uh, but it says it's a towing tractor. And I've never, uh, out of flea markets, thrift stores, I've never received, uh, any kind of Tomica cars. So that's actually kind of cool. So there's a Tomica. This is, which is my first street sweeper, but this is from Matchbox from 19, looks like 1999. And if you can get a hard focus camera, there we go, city service. And this little part actually dumps out and raises up, which is actually very cool. So very happy to have that in my collection. This is another Tomica. It's a... Uh, Hino semi trailer or Hino. Of course, you can pronounce it two different ways. There we go. Okay. This is a Matchbox uh, 1989. It is a Oldsmobile Aerotech, which is very cool because this back opens up. And let's see if I can, so you can see that just a little bit better. There you go. So very cool. This is for uh, Dismania. This is uh, Mikey from uh, Monsters Incorporated. Uh, pretty sure it's not Monsters University, uh, but it is Monsters Incorporated. So you can have that in your collection, which I will separate right now. Uh, this is another one that you might want, uh, Dismania. It doesn't come with the uh, projectile, but this is Mulan. So if you just want, uh, it's actually, um, there's a, as you can see, there's a steel ball here. Uh, so it does roll around, and it is actually kind of a hard plastic. And so it'd just be kind of cool as like a little desktop or something. So, Dismania, if you would like that in your box, I will gladly add that. Your box is getting extremely full right now, Dismania, which I do need to send out very shortly here. Hopefully, I can send that out uh, within the next, like, before December, because there is an awful lot in there. This is, uh, I'm assuming this is Thomas uh, the Tank Engine. I got a lot of these cars that I collect. Um, there's no label or a date mark on it. But that is going to go in my collection. And again, anything that I show off is mine unless I specifically say it's for that person or up for trade. Uh, here, this is going to go into my plastic figure collection in Indian, which I don't have many Indians. So that's cool to get that. And even though this is kind of a, you can see it's a cheaper, flatter version. 
uh, not much to it, but still it's pretty cool. I like the pose. Uh, next we've got a, let's see, I know it says, it says action and it's 164th scale Renard. It is a little Texaco race car. So very cool. Up next, we've got this, uh, I think it's a Racing Champions. And um, actually, you know who this is going to go to? Because I just realized this. Because I, I was just quickly looking at these cars. Let me show you the symbol here. There you go. I'm pretty sure that uh, Carlos would love to have this little die cast car. It is a, um, it's got real rubber tires and it's all metal and uh, the hood does open up and I will show you who's on there. There you go. It's got a little paint wear but it's a heavy car. It's got weight to it so I just thought that you might like to have that Carlos. Okay. And up next, we've got a Welly from 2001. It's a Yukon, uh, is it a Denali? So, very cool. Next, we've got a, I'm almost guaranteed that this is a Hot Wheels. This is an RD03. There you go. Okay. Next, we've got a, from 1999, Kellogg's Company Racing Champion. This is a Kellogg's Corn Flakes NASCAR. There we go. Very cool. Uh, we've got a 1996 Monte Carlo. This is a f plus. Uh, I'm trying to think of it's like a good wrench I'm trying to see some other little um, tempos on this but a little NASCAR there so very cool even though I'm not really into the NASCARs little plastic car that's gonna go in my cheapies I like kind of like that even though it's like all plastic and cheap but it's pretty cool and let's see what does it say here oh made in China oh, okay Next up, we've got a, another Tomica from 2001. This is a, Di, is it a Daihatsu uh, Copen? Okay, but it is this cool little police car that the doors open up. And I will open up the doors. It's got some paint wear, but very cool. Actually, this is actually really cool. I love this police car. And then, like I said, with the paint wear, it gives it some character. So very cool. Uh, next, this is a premium from McDonald's from 2011. It is the uh, Batmobile. Um, it uh, it does roll, but I'm not sure if it's supposed to come with another accessory. Um, this could possibly be up for trade if somebody needs to add this to their uh, premium collection or Batmobile collection. So this is a, a more than likely a uh, up for trade. Okay. Next up, we got this Racing Champions. Uh, it's a '77 Pacer. Uh, I'm trying to get the year. There's no year, but this is a Scooby Doo Shaggy Pacer. Very cool. I like that. Okay. Next up, we've got a Maisto, or Maisto, again, pronounced two different ways, I guess. This is a Chrysler 1956 uh, 300B, and it's from 2002. So, very cool. There you go. Next up, now, speaking of Maisto... This is a search truck from 2000, and I don't see many of these interesting Maestos, but like <clears throat> within like the last year or, or like a year ago or this year, there's been um, just plain looking cars, and this is actually an awesome looking car. This is going to go in my collection, Atomic Power Services, a Maesto car. I don't see many of these interesting kind of just either vehicles or service trucks, so it's very cool. 
Next up, we've got a Matchbox from 2007. It's a Quarry King, and it's got a very little movable part there of the shovel, but very cool construction vehicle. Now, I'm thinking that this one, it, it, it's a Hot Wheels from 1997. It's a, is it a Lakester? But I think it's, uh, somebody removed the top, because I'm pretty sure it doesn't look like that. So uh, somebody uh, removed the top. It's kind of a broken car, so that's just going to go in my junk uh, cars for any kind of interesting photography. Uh, up next, this is a Maisto little racer. It's a kind of a cheapy little G3, uh, or is it 63? I think it's 63, not G3. There we go. And whoops, sorry about the camera shake there. This is another Maisto, uh, no year, but it's like a little semi-trailer there. Or not a trailer, a little cab. I shouldn't say trailer because it's a cab. And it just doesn't want to do a hard focus, but you get the idea of what it looks like. Uh, this is a McDonald's Premium from 2006 Hot Wheels. I actually kind of like the look of that car. I love the color and love the bodywork on it. A little, little nice little model there. And it's got some weight to it too, which I kind of like, because like recent Hot, Wheel, Hot Wheels from McDonald's seem really light. This is a Tomica 2001, uh, which I actually really like this. This is a, um, uh, a thing for the airplane. Uh, I forget what this uh, stair thing. So that's actually really cool. Uh, up next, this is um, a wind-up from McDonald's from 2006, Disney Pixar Cars. Um, I guess, I don't know if someone, maybe it's just kind of dirty or whatever, or maybe just has to be cleaned up a little bit, but this can go to you, uh, Dismania, if you need to add it to your collection. Again, it's a little wind-up and it does move around, pretty cool. So let me know if you would like to have this in your collection. Uh, whoa, up next, I've got a, uh, Hot Wheels 66 Ford, or, I'm sorry, 56 Ford from 1999. It is a Harley Davidson vehicle, and hard focus, there we go, and, uh, hood opens up to expose more of the engine, okay, so very cool. Next, we've got a Matchbox 19 from 1989. It's a dump truck, and actually there's uh, been many of these down the line, down the years, and it's got the movable dumper. <clears throat> and here's another car for uh, Dismania to add to your collection. A little die-cast car, so I'm sure you would love to have that. Uh, next, this is a Matchbox from 1999, a 57 Chevrolet Bel Air, and very cool looking car. It's a Matchbox, and it's got some weight to it, which I love. So that's very cool. And we've got a, another Tomica from 2005. This is like a little, um, uh, construction vehicle, and as you can see, it's got a swiveling moving part. Uh, plastic right here, but uh, some of it is metal. So that's very cool. And right now, we've got a Maisto, uh, no year, but it is a truck. White pickup truck with the little truck bed there. You can see that. And we got another NASCAR from, I can't see the maker, but it is 2001. It's a Haviland Texaco. And hard focus, there we go. Okay, very cool. This was for, uh, separated from all the bags. This was for 35 cents. This is a, tow, uh, a towing bed truck. As you can see, it says Busted Knuckle Garage. It says Repair and Dispair under one roof. And it does have where well, you can slide it back and forth. And then you can slide it all the way down, like or all the way up. And then down. So, for $0.35, cents, I thought that was very cool. And it's metal. 
right there in plastic in the back. So very cool. <clears throat> Next we've got a, this has to be a Maisto, yes, and uh, just a Dodge, doesn't say anything else. Okay, so very cool. Um, this is a, never seen a Hot Wheels like this before. Uh, it says 1980, uh, something is covering this up so you can't really see it, but I've never seen a Hot Wheels like this before. And I don't know if you can do a hard focus to see, come on camera, hard focus to see the low decal there. But, looks like it's been, uh, slightly crushed, just a little bit, but, um, and I'm not sure if it's missing anything else because I haven't looked this up. But it's a Hot Wheels, so like, I thought that was really cool. Uh, next up is a Matchbox, it is a cement mixer, 2006, which I don't have cement mixer yet. So that would gladly go on my construction set. Very cool. And you know the color almost represents the um, transformer construction uh, cement mixer guy. Uh, we have a Racing Champions NASCAR from looks like the year 2000 Cartoon Network. This is uh, Powerpuff Girls. Come on hard focus camera. I absolutely need a new camera, which I'll be getting one here hopefully within the next year. This camera just, I don't know, just doesn't want to do a hard focus right now. I think it's focusing on other things in the background. There you go. Very cool. Okay. Oh, uh, this is another cheapy car. I knew there was a fourth one in there. That one goes, or is from Dollar Tree. Uh, up next we have a Maisto fire truck and it's incomplete because it still needs the extending ladder but that's fine with me okay this is a uh, it's a Takara I mean it's it's a Japanese vehicle it's missing the tires in the front as you can see because it's got the back tires but I just like this little tour bus so that was kind of cool. It's actually one of the reasons why I wanted to get this little bag of cars that was that this was in, because uh, I didn't also notice that the tires are missing. But that's okay. I I actually like the look of it. And we've got a 2006. Uh, that's all it says. 2006. I have no idea what this is. Um, I'm not sure if it's supposed to resemble like because it's got eyes like a like a bird. Or the body's like a bird. I'm not sure what that is. So, pretty cool. So it's going to go in my collection. We've got like another kind of, uh, it's not really a NASCAR, but it's supposed to resemble something like a NASCAR, but it's more like a truck. And of course, it's got the thing in the window. And it is missing the little roll cage thing here. So, okay. Uh, this one I actually kind of like because this is almost like a food truck. This is Atomica from 2007. It is a Subaru Sambar truck. And I'll show you the one site here that says Fresh Bakery. And in Japan it says, uh, it says Bonjour. So it says it's American Fresh Bakery. The baguettes that are in the bag is French and then Japanese at the bottom. That's pretty that's pretty funny. And then look, you got the Eiffel Tower, Bonjour on the side of the truck. And then on this side, it's almost like a food truck. It's uh, supposed to show that there's uh bread there. And then loaves of bread on the top. So I actually like that. That's that's kind of uh I'm going to use that in a toy photo cuz I actually really like that. Uh up next, this is a 2007 it says from Tommy a police helicopter with a grappling uh, little hook and it opens up so you can grab little people and it's got its propeller on both the top and the side so I actually thought that was kind of cool and I'll see if I can show it to you up close here there we go very cool I'm gonna go in my collection 
Uh, up next, we've got a Matchbox 2006. Oh, it says 2006 Viacom. The car is 2001. It's a VW W12 concept. It's a uh, sort of Diego car. Because that looks like the little character from Diego. So, there's that. Okay. Up next, we've got a Hot Wheels. It's called a Battle Spec. No year. But a very cool looking car. I actually kind of like the colors on that. And uh, that's it. Yeah. So, very cool. Uh, next, we've got a. It's just a Power Panel truck, 2002. Uh, I'm not even sure the maker on it, but Rescue EMS, and it says Desert Race 1000, big tires, big truck, there we go, and next we've got a Matchbox 2008, uh, it's a Pierce Dash fire engine, okay, hard focus, camera, there we go. Okay, and we got another NASCAR, I think the final NASCAR from 1996, and it says, a Happy Father's Day from Spree, prepaid uh, phone card or something like that. There we go. Okay, nothing exciting about that car, really. Uh, this is a Hot Wheels uh, 1994. It looks like it's another one of those scorpion cars. I don't think I have this color yet, so that will go in my collection. Okay. And let's see. Here's another Tomica from 2001. It's an Isuzu Elf. And I'm almost positive this is missing some parts. But still, I'm going to keep it. Add it to the collection. This is uh, just says made in China. It's a little F. 20 airplane. Uh, I think it's metal. Yeah. Kind of metal. Maybe a couple pieces of plastic in the body. Uh, let's see. We got two more cars and then my battery's about to be shot here and then I'll do the rest here in another video. Uh, I got a Hot Wheels Super Steiner. Looks like a big steam ray. There you go. And then finally, the last car is an all metal, which I like, except the wheels are plastic. It's a Tomica Fuse Truck Crane, is what it says. And it's missing the top little hook part. But I like this because it's metal, except for the crane part is plastic. The wheels are plastic, but the body is all metal, which I love. So, very cool. Okay, so I'm going to end the video right there. I do have other toys to show you. But I'm running out of battery. I'm going to have to switch it out. So, really quickly, in the comments below, just let me know what uh, die-cast car that you thought was very cool or one that was your favorite. Also, in the uh, descriptions, there is my Flickr toy page where I have all my toy photography that I do. And also, in the description below, uh, be sure to check out all my friends in the Collector's Talk Trading Circle. Check out their videos and their toy collections and their toy pickups. So until next time, this is Bosco signing off.